<laughs> All right, welcome to Garnett and Sam's news, uh, wor world news actually. So uh, there's a breaking, we got a breaking news story here. Huge news. If you can't read the board. If you are dyslexic and cannot read the board, it says Walmart has banned pork and turkey. Yeah, we do a pig and a turkey. It's got so, uh, thousands of pounds of pork and turkey products from Georgia's prepared food sold in Walmart are being recalled over fear that they may have been contaminated with salmonella. You know, the foodborne illness, not the fish. Like, yeah, yeah. The, uh, the U.S. Department of Agriculture's Food Safety and Inspection Service, FSIS, announced a total of 6,444 pounds of ready-to-eat pork sausage and turkey patty products are affected. That's a lot of, that's a lot of meat. That's a lot of meat. All right. That's my meat. And uh, are urging customers who may have bought the, the items in question not to eat them, you know, consume. The FSIS is concerned that some products may be frozen and in consumers' refrigerators or freezers or both. That made no sense. The agency said in a statement, consumers who have purchased these products are urged not to consume them. These products should be thrown away or returned to the place of purchase, period. The recall- Did they get money back for that? Oh, I, I think they should get some money back for that. That is yeah, yeah. Uh, the recall was announced after it was found that George's Prepared Foods third party cold storage facility had inadvertently shipped the ready to eat products from the storage into commerce. From, all right, whatever. The company confirmed it is conducting a class one voluntary recall of the product as a small quantity of its food items tested positive for salmonella in its facility in Carryville, Tennessee. Under USDA recall classifications, a class one recall means that there is a reasonable probability that consuming or using the product will cause serious adverse health consequences or death. That's not good. There have been no confirmed reports or adverse reactions or illness due to anyone consuming the sausage and turkey products. According to the Center for Diseases Control and Prevention, CDC, salmonella is the leading cause of bacteria foodborne illness in the United States. It is responsible for an estimated 1.4 million cases of foodborne illness and more than 400 deaths in the U.S. every year. That's a lot of deaths. And that's quite a bit. Symptoms include diarrhea. Hershey squirts. I get that after McDonald's. Abdominal cramps and fever from around 12 to 72 hours after eating the contaminated product. That's a lot of minutes. Most people can recover after around four to seven days without treatment. Although death can occur with older people, infants or those who, with weakened immune systems, in some cases the diarrhea can be so severe <laughs> that the Hershey squirts. The patient may require hospital treatment. Alrighty, uh, that's all we have to say to Garnett uh, and Sam's of World News. Thank you for tuning in. And uh, like I said, Walmart has bad pork and turkey. We'll see you next time.